Hey guys, so, um, Monday again, and can I just say how cool you guys are? You guys have all just, like, excellent taste in, like, music and TV shows especially. Um, I just think you guys are all fabulous, and I'm so excited we're all on the channel together because I'm sure we're all gonna be super best friends from now on forever and ever and ever, and I just, you guys are fantastic. Um, I, I, I... I don't, I don't know, um, I'll, I'll leave, like, I guess, individual responses in, like, my description down, down there, the doobly-doo to, like, your videos, because I feel like I don't have enough time here, um, but, so the theme, but, so, the theme this week, we have a theme, themes, the theme this week is embarrassing holiday stories, and I, I don't, like, I have funny holiday stories, not really embarrassing, I haven't really embarrassed myself ever, I mean, I embarrass myself every day, but nothing that stands out related to the holidays. Um, so, one story is we had a, a flying squirrel in our Christmas tree. We bought a Christmas tree, a live one from upstate, and we, like, chopped it down, took it home, and we set it up in the living room, and our cats could not get enough of this tree. They just walked around the edges and walked around the... all the time. And our cats are, like, wild cats. They don't really care about anything. So, like... The fact that they were, like, stalking this tree was, like, the weirdest thing ever. And then one night in the middle of the night, we hear all this noise. And my mom goes downstairs, and the cats are climbing the tree, in the tree, like, with the ornaments, just in the tree. And out of nowhere, a flying squirrel jumps out of the tree and, like, runs all around the house. And, like, we had to, like, catch the cats. And, like, the, the flying squirrel got out, so it didn't die or anything. But, like, it was ridiculous because we had like a, a nest of flying squirrels living in this tree we had to get them all out like it was more than one like it was lots of flying squirrels a lot of them Ugh. i'm so bad at, i keep looking at the looking at the thing and not the camera whatever and then my other one uh this isn't like i don't know but i don't i don't know what the story is i don't know what it is but so we um we were visited by some family friends, and they bring us Christmas presents every year. And my little sister got this really, really nice... She likes to cook, so she got this really, really nice spice set in, like, a nice wooden case with glass glass over the top. It was beautiful. It was obviously really expensive. It was gorgeous. I got Old Navy Men's Extra Large $7 pajama pants. Um, so my running theory is that they forgot to bring get me a present and they were like oh hun i got you new pajama pants let's just give them to her um and i was like thanks thanks and i was like appreciative because like it was nice of them to get me a gift and all but i was really confused as to why they got me these and then i put them on and they're so comfortable i wear them like every night when i go to bed and kate doesn't use her spice rack so I don't know. I think my present ended up being better, even though they like they left the tag on with the price and everything. They were seven dollar men's extra large old navy, and they are the most comfortable pair of pants that I own. Like I come home and I put on my gigantic pajama pants because I have no friends or life. But yep, that's my that's my fantastic Christmas tree Christmassy story. I I just want to say like I'm really excited about this channel and I'm excited about you guys and if I could remember specifically like the things I wanted to respond to in each of your videos I'd do it now but I forget so see down below oh, you guys are so cool